Hey guys, so as you can see, most of my face is already done. Um, I wanted to make this tutorial, not really tutorial, but like kind of tutorial, a little bit faster um, just because, you know, I only have so much time before work tonight and before work I need to take all of this makeup off and I have other videos to film as well. So I already have my foundation, my concealer, powder, contour and blush on and then the rest is going to be a Shanixo inspired look using the Jeffree Star Beauty Killer Palette. I also figured I would go ahead and make everything I have that I can use from Jeffree Star. So I'm also going to be using the Jeffree Star Emani MUA Uranus Skin Frost and the Birthday Sue Lip Ammunition from his summer collection. So let's get started. So this is what the Beauty Killer Palette looks like. Um... It's super, 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 super pretty. So, <laughs> I'm very excited. That's not what I wanted. So I'm gonna go in with my e.l.f. eyelid primer. Um, and just prime my eyes. I'm very <laughs> excited. Shan XO did such a great job with this look that I just, I needed to, I needed to copy. Um, I'll have a link down below with um, her tutorial in case you want to watch it because I love her so I'm, I don't feel bad giving her credit. Um, I would give anyone credit by the way. So in order to set that eyelid primer, I'm going to go into this, sh this shade right here. It's called China White. So how you guys doing? Alrighty. Now that we've set our eyelids, I'm gonna go in with this e.l.f. blending eye brush and I'm gonna go into this shade which is called Courtney and start putting that in my crease as a transition shade. I think it's a really pretty shade and it's just as Jeffree Star said in his reveal video it's like the perfect transition shade If you want a full-on review video of this palette, um, just let me know down in the comments below and I will do that for you. I'm just going to go in with the Wet n Wild blending brush and just blend that shade out a little. Um, if you're wondering, I'm going to put a picture here of um, Shanixo's look. She loosely was inspired by Manny MUA and now I'm inspired by her. So, really exciting. Can't remember exactly what she did and I didn't really want to watch the video just because I didn't want it to be exactly what she did. So if it is exactly what she did, I apologize, but mine's just inspired by her. How's that? That looks good. So I'm going to go back to that e.l.f. brush, and I'm going to go into the shade Star Power. It's that really nice hot pink. Oh, I'm so nervous. Oh my god. I'm so excited. Nervous. Because it kind of stained my hand the other day. So I'm kind of nervous that it's going to stain my eye. And I have work tonight. But that's okay. 
I'll just look like I have pink eye. Going back in with that wet and wild brush to blend. Oh my god. <laughs> Guy. I'm trying really hard to blend it, but these bright colors, not even just in Jeffrey's palette, let's be honest, just bright colors in general are kind of hard to blend. And bright colors in general are really hard to um make too. So the fact that he made one that's actually pretty blendable, well, uh, you know what I mean. Like, huzzah to him. Like, it's a little hard to blend, but again, most bright colors are. So, I'm just going to keep blending. Sorry I'm using, like, this mirror and you might not be able to see me. I'm trying to make it so you can. But I just kind of need to see what I'm doing. gonna go back in with Courtney a little bit to help blend it out and then if I need to I'll go back into star power which I think I'm gonna need to <laughs> ah. Courtney just took it away so I really can't use Courtney to help blend unfortunately <laughs> I've been so excited to play with this palette ever since it came to my doorstep. Just throwing that out there. I'm not, at this point, I don't really care if it's perfect. I can make it a cut crease. I need to go in with more star power on this side to even it out. There we go. <laughs> Let's make it look so I got pink eye. There we go. Now they're somewhat even. I think I need to go in a little bit more with star power on my left eye. It's kind of becoming a cut crease, but that's okay. Because this is just a Shanix O inspired. It's not supposed to be exactly what she did. Again, if it does end up being exactly what she did... It's whatever, but sometimes you just need that inspiration. And if it comes out the same, it comes out the same. If it doesn't, it doesn't. All I remember is she did Star Power in the Crease, um, Princess on the Lid, which I am going to do, Inexpensive on the Lower Lash Line, which again I am going to do. Um, other than that, I'm not positive what she did. I can't remember if it was a cut crease. I can't remember really anything about the look. So, I'm just kind of playing it by ear. 
So I'm gonna go in with my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk just to give myself a little bit more base to put Princess on. I think it'll look a lot better with that white base down. I mean, <laughs> Most poppin' shades do. Alright, so I got that milk base down. And then I'm going to take my Wet n Wild. Um, the name's gone. Normally the name's on here, isn't it? Maybe not. Okay, so I'm going to go in with my Wet n Wild flat shader brush and I'm gonna go into this shade which is princess um, this actually reminds me a lot of his highlighter princess cut so I think princess cut was um, loosely inspired around this shade Hoo -hoo. I hate ruining the J. And now I'm just gonna blend again. That looks so pretty, guys. Do I look like Jeffrey yet? <laughs> Alright. So now, I'm going to take this side of my Naked Ultimate Basics brush. Um, it's like a little pencil brush, and I'm going to take the shade... Oh, actually, first, I'm going to take... What? Oh, do I have a blue? I, I do! So, I'm going to take my um, Rimmel Scandalize Waterproof Col Kajal Eyeliner in Light Blue, and I'm going to put that in my waterline. Can you see that? Oh yeah, you can. Cool. So now I'm going to take the bottom of the Naked Ultimate Basics and I'm going to go into the shade Expensive and I am going to put that on the lower lash line. I don't generally put things on my lower lash line. I think for me it just kind of looks a little ridiculous. But... Like I said before, hmm, I'm so excited. And I'm going to take the other side, go back into Courtney, and just blend, oh, and just blend that out.
gonna just touch it up a little. Oh my god, I'm so excited. This looks so good. Alright. Now I'm going to go in with some mascara. I'm going to be using my uh, oh, Jordana Best Lash Extreme. I'm going to put it on the top and lower lash line. Just because with the lower lash line color, my lower lashes kind of need it. I'm I'm just going to do this and then come back. All right, so I'm back. My mascara is done. This isn't the best mascara for the lower lash line, but I currently don't have any for the lower lash line. So we're going to have to make it work. And then just to touch up a little bit of this inner corner where I got some mascara on, I'm just going to go back in with Princess and just fix that. There we go. And then, for my inner corners, I'm gonna find an inner corner brush. There we go. And I'm just gonna go back into the China White and use that. I'm also gonna use that up and in my brow bone. <sighs> Sorry, again, if I'm looking more over here than I am at you, this is just where my mirror is. <sighs> so. <sighs> I've never gone this bold with my makeup. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Sorry if I'm seeming a little crazy. I've never gone this bold with my makeup. So I'm going into my Wet n Wild Mega Clear Brow and Lash Mascara, and I'm just gonna set my brows. And like I said, just to make this a little more fun, I figured let's make it a all around Jeffrey video as much as I can. So I'm gonna go in with my Jeffree Star Cosmetics in at Manny Amiway. Collab Skin Frost in the shade Uranus. I think they did that on purpose. <sighs> this is what it looks like. It's so pretty. <sighs> and I'm going to take my e.l.f. highlight brush. And I'm just going to highlight. Woohoo! Oh, look at that glow, though. That glow. <laughs> and now I'm just going to blend it out a little because, well, that's a little bit of us. That's not the I'm taking my Real Techniques stiffle brush and I'm going to blend that out. Then I'm gonna go into um, the summer collab, the summer collection I had from him, and I'm gonna use the lip ammunition in the shade birthday suit. Super pretty. This color is literally my lip color, but better. I really love his lip ammunition um, 
formula. It's really nice. All right, so that is the final look. I don't know how well you can see it, but I love it. <laughs> so let me know down below. What do you think? Bye.